It's so sad to hear that uh, Islamic law is criminalizing Christianity. In Iraq, we have so much persecution, sacking the monasteries in Syria, so many countries in the Middle East. But then again, that's uh, Islamic uh, law, the Islamic State laws criminalize Christianity. They've been doing the, that since the year 711 when they invaded the Iberian Peninsula of Spain. In the year 718, the Alvears, my family, they crowned King Don Pelayo and they were the resistance. In the year 1000, the monks, the monastery of Santo Toribio of Lieban, they depicted, they uh, created images of the Book of Revelation and uh, the false prophet, the beasts of the apocalypse were, uh, was Islam and there was a 700 year occupation until 1492 of an Islamic State uh, uh, rule and their laws criminalized Christianity which means if you're a Muslim and you become a Christian that's that sentence and basically what's happening in Iraq they expel all the all the Christians and they sack down all the churches that's Islamic law and proof of that is right now in the Middle East. No? I, I just wish it doesn't grow bigger uh, as it did uh, uh, 1300 years ago. And uh, the whole West, Europe and America uh, are subdued. subdued. And uh, we have a Sharia law, Islamic State law here in the West because there's going to be a lot of persecution against us, man. Still, we will survive, you know, another 700 years of diaspora. Instead of 17, this is like the 700 years of diaspora. No? And this has been a Paxim uh, World, a Universal News reporting to you.